Hi, this is Nikki and I am going to share the angel guidance that they want to for me to share with you today. So we have the, this is using the Archangels and Gemstones Guardian cards, um, which is perfect because on the crystal grid that I do for all divine love, um, it is all using angelic and crystal energies um, with the Holy Fire and the Holy Fire Reiki is a direct divine source basically it's extremely powerful extremely soothing and is quite an incredible energy so this is the guidance that they want for today and again this fits in so well because uh, i think this is just a nod to the last message that i put out about that we are being divinely guided and then this is the card that i pulled so it's archangel raziel I am extremely intuitive. My spirit guides and angels send me messages all the time. I am grateful for divine guidance. My mind is clear and all knowledge is available. I awaken my consciousness. I am calm and I am at peace. It's like they're actually talking to you, isn't it? <laughs> From one message to the other. Um, okay, and the crystal is Azurite and this is to improve intuition so it activates your third eye and increases your sensory gifts you receive messages from the divine all the time it is now time to notice the signs interpret them and use the higher guidance to create ease in your life okay so this is just about you know all the messages that we're getting um the more that you open yourself up to see the signs the more you will and the more that you ask for that divine guidance the more it will come as well so um, if you're wanting to expand the messages that the universe gives you and your higher self gives you then um, really it's a question of just it's just a case of asking for it and then letting and then being aware of the signs because they will come in everything um, if you've been following this channel, then you'll see they come in adverts and music and songs and conversations with people in objects, you know, everything. Um, and the other bit that I wanted to share with you is about um, energy clearing. So if every day you um, do as part of your practice and say that you want to release all energy that is not serving your highest good and your highest path. Um, and you, when you do that, you imagine yourself connecting to the light. And you will see, you'll either see parts of that energy, you know, the root cause of that energy. You can ask yourself, what is the root cause of it? What is it? You know, you might get a picture, you might get, you know, a color you might get it really depends on what your soul and what your suit your subconscious gives you um, you send that energy up to the light and you say and when you send it up to the light you will receive the gift back from the light once you receive that gift back from the light and again it could be anything that your subconscious wants to give you then you pat that into your energy field three times right so, and you do it every day, or maybe three times a day. It's just like a quick check to say, is there anything, any energies that I am ready to release now, which are not serving my highest good? Connect to the light, send it up to the light, bring it back, bring the gift back and pat that into your energy field. The reason why you have to do it all the time is because your higher consciousness will only release stuff when it's ready to be released, right? So, and it may be that it needs to be released a number of times because we are like, a, <clears throat> we are like an onion with layers and layers and layers and layers and layers of energetic fields. So it's just really good practice to do it all the time or whenever you're consciously aware of it, right? So if you just think, okay, I'm gonna release any energies that aren't serving my highest good now, release it up to the light, let the light give you a gift, pat it back into your energy field. And um, when you do that, this is just, a, you know, basically this is just really good practice to clear out your energy so you can allow much more of the love vibration into you. So the more that you do that, the more you can let in the love and light. 
Okay, well, anyway, they just wanted to share that. So just do that as part of your daily practice. And um, you will clear, you will become a clear channel for more and more love, more and more golden stardust energy. Always put yourself in golden star bubble um, because that golden energy is also incredibly powerful. Okay, well, I hope that helps you and I hope you have a great day. And please do keep saying your prayers for your divine counterparts for help in them coming home and also for Tuffy to help Tuffy come home. Okay, have a great day. Bye.